What's up guys? Welcome to this week's video. So, because it's been a lot warmer, we are doing another Dutch oven video. Before we go on, let us know down in the comments what your favorite thing is to cook in the Dutch oven. Today we're gonna be doing chicken enchiladas, one of our favorites, but so let us know. Good. Let us know what you guys like to do because we're gonna try and do one Pops. Dutch oven video every week. Okay, so for chicken enchiladas you need Cheese. Then we use canned chicken. You can do normal chicken too, but it's just faster. The good thing about this is it doesn't need to cook. Yeah. So everything in here, it just needs to warm up. And then you need a can of cream of chicken, a can of black beans, but you're gonna rinse this out and everything. Cream cheese, cottage cheese, corn tortillas, and salsa. salsa. We aren't gonna be fancy and do the enchiladas that you roll, you can do that, it just takes more time. Pretty much what we're gonna do is throw everything in, but it's also something that you can do while you are out camping. You can just throw it all together. You don't have to get it ready at home, just do it out there. So, what you do, what we do, so we always use one of these Dutch oven liners, and that just makes cleanup so much easier. Because all you do is you throw your food in here, and once you're done, you just take it out, throw it away, throw it in the fire, whatever. If you haven't used these, do it. We'll link them down below if you want to try them out. All right, we're going to use the dump and mix method. Yep. You dump all this stuff into this bowl and mix it up and then you put it in here. We don't have like exact measurements of what you're supposed to use. You just use as much as you think you're going to want. So you can get this chicken anywhere. We got it at Costco because they're a little bit bigger, but they have them at Walmart. They're just smaller. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, that coming out looks disgusting. And you just, like I said, you just use as much of this stuff as you want. This is the stuff that's going in between your layers of tortilla. Don't get me wrong. You can't go wrong with potatoes and meat in a Dutch oven. But enchiladas also. Game changer. Super good. So this is what your mixture is gonna look like. This is what's going in between your tortilla layers. Now you grab your tortillas. So, and you don't just lay them down, you rip them up. Okay, so that's pretty much what we're gonna be doing the whole time. Tortilla layer, mixture layer. Tortilla, well, and our cheese, but you get the idea, you just layer it all. All right, so now we'll just go up, up the mountains okay. and cook it. <laughs> here we go. Okay, so we made it here in American Fort Canyon, one of our favorite spots. All you have to do is get your coals going, throw them on the Dutch oven and under it, and then wait. Tell them how much we got this bag for. We got two of them at Walmart, these big boys, for eight bucks. Eight bucks! Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you get when I burn my eyebrows off, like last time. Okay, take a look at the butamus enchiladas. Get up real close. Mmm. Mm. Oh yeah. They're really good. <laughs> How long was that cooking? Cooked, or it warmed, because nothing had to cook, so it warmed up for 30, 40 minutes, around there. It was probably done 20 minutes ago, but we like it really hot, so. They made a cheesecake in that Dutch oven. <laughs> we'll see, we're risking it. It's gonna be awesome. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching this week's video. We had so much fun eating that Super enchiladas. Super good, Super good. And Must do. we hope you like it too. In the comments down below, be sure to put down if you ever made it before or if you made it after watching this. Yep. Well, hit that big, <laughs> hit that, what is that? Give one? it a thumbs up. Get a thumbs up if you liked it and hit that big red subscribe button. See ya. See you next time. Take a look at the butamus enchiladas. Get up real close.